My name is Rob Benedict, and I play uh, Peter, uh, Dr. Peter Freeman. I am uh, an old friend, an old flame of Susanna's, and I'm, you know, her doctor friend that she goes to in this situation where she needs some advice and needs some help. Peter, hi. I think my sister's coming apart. What do you mean? She said her baby's a stranger to her. It's all her fault. She should go. Go where? I don't know, but I don't like the way that sounds. Yeah, no kidding. Susanna not knowing how to handle it calls me one of the only people she can think of. And again, we have this old relationship and a really bond. I care about her deeply. And so, you know, it's beyond sort of doctor patient. Like, I want to help her. Can you handle it? Yeah. I mean, what choice do I have? Because it's, you know, either a family member or... Or the state gets into it all. Yep. Can you take off work? No, not, not right now. For a few days even? No, not now. Can your mom help? No, no, she's, she's busy. She's busy, huh? But you'll have help. Yeah, yeah, I'll have to. And I think there's a sense that maybe she walked away with something with, with Peter that could have been deeper, but maybe she wasn't ready or, you know, that we, we've talked about a couple scenarios with what happened there. Maggie and I, and she's, you know, she's lovely and it's easy to have a connection with her and, and I feel like we have a connection and, and so, yes, I can see that happening. I think that that is their intention, that there could be something there. But she's got a boyfriend, her character has a boyfriend, so we'd have to work around that. Uh, at this point, I'm just, you know, just, I care about her and I would love for something to happen, but we'll see, we'll see. Can I see my sister? She's out cold. Uh, apparently, she didn't sleep for three days for fear that something would happen to her daughter. <sighs> Boy, that's rough. But she's, she's on an IV, being hydrated and sedated. Thank you so much for coming over. Really. Anything for you. All right. She's yours now. Um, you know, it's interesting. Sometimes, um, as an actor, you have a script for months. You audition five or six times and you know, you get it and by the time you get it, you know it so well. And sometimes like this, uh, I hadn't even seen it and said, until like the day before we started shooting. They called and they said they wanted me to come do this and uh, told me who was involved and I, I read it real quick and I was like, oh yeah, it's great, it's a home run, you know, to, to work with Maggie and Anna um, and John, the director, you know, on this is, uh, it's, it's, it's fantastic. And the fact that it's on the web is even more exciting to me, you know, to be a part of, because it feels like this new thing. And it kind of breaks it down. It makes you feel like you're really making art. Peter, I'm sorry to call you on your cell. How is she? She's not answering her phone. <sighs> Listen, this sounds serious. If you feel like she might hurt the baby, then go right to the ER. Okay, I will. Okay, and call 911 if necessary. Okay. It really feels like everybody's like rolling their sleeves up and getting back to what it really is about. So that's cool to be a part of.